Well, that's not a rule, that's just a personal preference. That <laughs> Political jokes are limited. For example, if I were to come out here and tell a joke that knocked Brian Mulroney, I would be in danger of offending up to 15% of the population. <laughs> And, however, I'm assured that by the fall convention in London, that will be okay. <laughs> as long as Mr. Mulrooney himself is not in the audience. I have uh, canvassed a number of people for humorous sallies with which I could regale you. And nobody actually gave me any except Neil Aitchison himself. He was kind enough to share some material with me. I'm not going to announce in advance which is Neil's material. As soon as I see what your reaction is, I will announce whether it was his or mine. <laughs> he passed on to me a joke about Harriston. Being a very small town, of course, each small town has uh, characters with which everyone is familiar. And old Buck is the Harriston character. I hear humming in the background, and yes, just as I thought, here goes the green light, so I'm going to come back to Harriston in just a few moments. And I'm going to try and turn the page calmly in order to find the correct page. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen, your next chorus from the St. Thomas chapter under the direction of Rick Wilson, the Elgin Heirs. Come 